last video of this series, we followed water on its journey from river to treatment. In this episode, we're looking at how water travels through thousands of miles of pipes to reach your taps. Every single day, around 2.6 billion litres of water is cleaned and delivered to 10 million customers across London and the Thames Valley. Now, that's a lot of cups of tea. Water is pumped to customers through a huge network of pipes and pumping stations. We're talking over 20,000 miles of pipe. So, so Bav, leaks can spring up due to the age of the pipes, but more leaks spring up due to extreme weather. Why right. is this? Why does this happen? It's to do with uh, heat and sort of heat and cold, just sort of expands and, and um, compresses, mm -hmm. and it just puts strains on the old network that we have already. Over the last 20 years, Thames Water has replaced nearly 2,000 miles of old pipes to keep water flowing safely. Pipes are under pressure 24 hours a day, so leaks are inevitable on such a big network. Thames Water has reduced leakage for three consecutive years, bringing it to its lowest ever level since 2020. Achieving a leakage level of zero is not possible in any water system. But Thames Water is using innovative technology like listening devices that detect the sound of water escaping underground to help control leaks. I can't hear nothing. No, no. So Brilliant. You guys are doing a good no job. Leaks. No leaks. No leaks. <laughs> <laughs> There's also something called a self-sealing aqua box, which can find and fix small leaks from the inside. So you don't even need anyone to look at it. It will just fix it by itself. That, that's amazing. Okay, so Bav, I heard under the grapevine that there's some new innovative tech yeah. that they're using to hear when there's leaks underground. Like there's a new listening device yeah. that you can use to hear tech, like water leaking underground. Correct, yeah, too? 100%. Thames Water is also investing millions more to replace water mains across the network. As well as prioritizing fixes based on how much water a leak is losing. During the summer, Thames Water have installed 34,000 smart meters in the Thames Valley. To Bav, installing extra smart meters can help customers take control of their water use and also spot hidden leaks. Correct. Now, the spotting of the hidden leaks is where I'm a bit confused. How is it spotting hidden leaks? A few ways it does it. We've got an older meter that has a cog in the middle. So as soon as you turn your tap on within anywhere in the house, mm -hmm. your cog in the center of that um, meter will start to spin. Yeah. If, if you then shut your water off or you're not using any of your taps within the property mm -hmm. and you notice that that cog is still spinning in the house, mm -hmm. that means to suggest that you have a leak somewhere in the property. Yeah. Um, the same applies with outside. Mm -hmm. um, you also have digital meters now, mm. which are really good, high tech. Um, that, that sort of helps Thames Water and the customer because mm -hmm. the customer has an accurate way of reading their their meter mm -hmm. and once you have a meter obviously you're only paying for what you use yeah water is precious and our supplies are under pressure if you'd like to help make the most of every drop why not head over to the thames water website for water and money saving advice